there guys, my name is Kirsty Shardongster Bomb, but built for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park News room update where today we're going to be looking at Karls Erlebnisdorf Rovers Hagen. Uh, so, of course, Rovers t-shirt. <laughs> a bit of a reference there. Uh, but, we're looking at the other Karls Adventure Village theme park, the, the other Karls Erl Erlebnisdorf theme park in Rovers Hagen. So, uh, we looked at... Um, the one in Elstal near Berlin uh, with their brand new flying umbrella attraction which is the Zampella Disco Coaster. This time Rovers Hagen have announced a brand new Gerslau Skyflight for next year. Um, so we're looking at all the details surrounding this brand new attraction, show you the concept art and also my thoughts on this attraction just like we did with the other cars theme park. So before we get started guys make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you never miss another YouTube video. Uh, we're getting closer and closer to 2,000 subscribers and nearly half a million views. And for now, let's get straight onto it and let's have a look at this brand new attraction. So this is Maya's Wild Sisters, which is going to be a brand new Gerstler Skyfly for the 2021 season. Guests can experience an interactive flight experience, the intensity of which can be regulated themselves at Carl's Adventure Village in Rovers Hagen. Some time ago, the amusement park in Rostock announced with a discreet note on its receipts they would open a new flight attraction called Maya's Wild Sisters in spring 2021. It's now been revealed that the facility will be a Gerstler Skyfly that can be operated interactively. Uh, Maya's Wild Sisters, or as it's known in Germany, Maya's Wilde Schwesten, passengers take a seat in one of 12 individual seats. Um, which is designed as bees and have wings on the sides can be removed to use control sticks while driving. If they do this skillfully, they can take perform several lateral flaps in a row. And if the wings are not operated, however, passengers can enjoy a leisurely sightseeing flight at around 50 km per hour at a height of up to 20 meters. So everyone decides for themselves how fast the trip will be. Now the park said quiet ride or wild rollover. Swing up to lofty heights and determine your own flight experience. Now this ride should not only offer the exciting ride, but also a learning effect. From March 26th, you can learn everything about wild beasts from Carl's and become a pollen collector yourself, says the amusement park. Among other things, Carl's will explain the difference between honeybees and wild bees to its visitors. The official opening is set to take place on March 26th, 2021, and as we all know with the Skyfly, it is manufactured by the German, uh, coincidentally a German manufacturer, Gerslar. So that is the update on Marge's Wilde Svesten, uh, or Marge Meyer's Wild Sisters, uh, which is the brand new Skyfly attraction at Karls Adventure Village, or no, also known as Karls Erlesnisdorf Rovershagen. Uh, my German pronunciation is awful, as you can tell. Um, but I like the sound of this attraction. I love the sound of this attraction, as you saw by the concept art, the logo, the look of the ride. Again, it's that same style of cartoony concept art that was the same kind of style um, as the park uh, off with the other park offered with the flying umbrella concept art that I showed you uh, just a couple of days ago. Um, very, very exciting. Not going to lie. Very, very exciting stuff from the park and really, really exciting indeed. And, you know, I reckon the, the look of the ride will dominate the actual feel of the ride. I think it's going to look brilliant. Um... It kind of gives me garden plant vibes. I don't know what you think, but it's like sitting in your own bee, I guess. And you sort of, you sort of become Marge. You sort of, I think the name Marge's Wild Sisters or Wilde Schwestern. Uh, you become a Wild Schwestern. Um, but you know, I think it's the whole experience of becoming a bee, and you're flying around with Maya, and you're sitting in the bee. You get to fly over. You get to, you can either do like a nice sightseeing, or you can do some nice barrel rolls. Whatever you like to do. <laughs> Um, but I like the sound of this attraction. I like the feel of the attraction. I like the theme of the attraction. Um, I like that because um, obviously, I, you know, some people watching will no, not know much about this park. Um, but I, I think this is going to give the park a lot more recognition than they already have and already deserve. Um, I think both parks. I think Elstor with the new disco coaster from Zampella and this Rovers Hagen Gerstler Skyfly. I think both parks are getting too brilliant attractions for 2021 and it's going to give the park a lot of recognition i only found out about this park a couple of years ago and it was it was an interesting looking park it had some like like strawberry and like different themed rides and 
you know, it was a very weird park, and, well, Europe is weird sometimes, but, um, you know, they had some weird creations, and it's nice to see another interesting and unique creation to a popular ride system. The Zampella Disco Coaster at the other park is a popular ride system, and I like what they've done with that, flying in an umbrella along the airtime hill, and they're doing the extended route. With this one, I like how it's a fully-fledged themed B-themed Skyfly. It's a particularly good ride system. You know, you guys that have ridden a Skyfly, like Skyforce or Blackpool Pleasure Beach, you will know what Skyfly does. A uh, Skyfly does, not Skyflyer, obviously. Uh, um, but the Gerslai Skyfly, those of you who have ridden Skyforce or Blackpool Pleasure Beach, among other creations, will know how this works. And, you know, it's a very, it's a very interesting ride system. It's a very mixed ride system where you could do the insane route or you could just do a nice gentle sightseeing route and I like how cars have adapted the option to give you that opportunity to do either option and I think this and I might be wrong about this but you guys can comment down below if you agree or not I think on even on paper before this is being constructed and opened I think this is the best themed Skyfly attraction and in the world and one of the best themed flat rides in the world arguably in my opinion because I think what cars have done is they took theming to a whole new level with this and I reckon this is going to be a brilliant looking attraction so comment down below your thoughts and opinions I'd love to hear them and uh, this is going to be a very interesting attraction when it opens in, at the end of March next year. So thank you very much guys for watching this video on Carl's Erlebnisdorf Rovershagen on the brand new Myers Wild Schwesten. Um, I like reporting on these small European parks. I like giving them the news coverage they deserve. And that's the same with other parks around the world that are small and don't get much coverage. So comment down below any new attractions for next year or beyond, beyond 2021. Uh, at other parks around Europe and around the world that you've seen, you want to uh, message me about them. All my social media links are in the description down below. So if you do spot anything part news, send it into Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, TikTok, anywhere. And of course, I'll reply to your message as soon as I can. But I will reply to everyone, of course. Thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you never miss another video. And for now, my name is Coast Shell. Keep living the coast of life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a thrill, fantastic day.